Hey guys, a very quick intro before we start the vlog. I just want to make a little bit of background before it starts because you might be like, why is it about Italy? Isn't this channel about Korea? And yes, it's about Korea, but I am before everything a travel passionate. So I've been traveling to 20... 21, 22, 22, I think 22 countries. It's really the thing I love the most in the world. But as you might know these days, unfortunately, because of COVID, it's pretty much impossible to travel. So this channel is more about traveling than Korea. It just happens that I live in Korea. So I mostly do videos about Korea. However, I don't know and don't think I'm gonna live in Korea forever. So I don't wanna be restricted by putting my channel in a box and saying that it's only about Korea. So I'm gonna make travel videos when I can travel again. Don't worry, there are gonna be videos about Korea still. I have a four year visa there and I've only finished my first year. So there are gonna be lots of other videos about Seoul and Korea. So don't worry, don't unsubscribe because I'm making a video about another country. So to make a little bit of context, uh, I am 25% Italian and I've been going to Italy every single year since I'm seven years old to my grandpa's village but unfortunately because of life and COVID I haven't been able to go there for about three years so for my mom's birthday we decided to go with both of my parents and my brother back there for a week to have some family holidays and this is what I filmed this vlog is gonna be in two parts because it's a little bit too long and I don't like long videos so I I don't know if you guys do but i rather make two 15 minute videos than a 30 minute one so yeah i hope this intro was short enough and let's just get started <laughs> oh and get vaccinated <laughs> I just arrived and it's already smelling like pastries and coffee everywhere <laughs> This is Italy over there under the clouds. La maison marche, la maison. We arrive home. It's about 1,000 degrees outside. Oh my gosh. Well, it's been so long since I've been here. We ate. We're kind of tired, but not that much. Like we slept about like four or five hours and because the flight was a six and we're gonna rest a little and then we're gonna head to the beach.
Hey there. So today is day two and I'm currently eating my breakfast and drinking my coffee. I was walking up by my parents doing some kind of housework. I have no idea what they're doing, but it was so noisy. Anyways, today I'm gonna be in a good mood. Yesterday, yesterday was fun, but I was extremely tired. So everybody was kind of uh, sensitive about everything we all have very big tempers in this family so it's easy to like kind of argue about anything but i feel like everybody's in a better mood today so it should be a nice day we have plans to go to this little city called taormina it's really close to my village it's very very pretty if you ever come to sicily you have to go there it's the very typical italian town with yellow and pink houses people drinking coffees in the street it's very touristic but i don't know about about today because you know about the oh my fucking oh my god i that was like the biggest insect i've ever seen it was like the size of my fist in black but did you hear the sound though well i don't know if it's going to be very touristic because of covid but i hope not because it can be really really crowded sometimes yeah today is hot every day is kind of the same temperature here 30 32 degrees i'm speaking not so loud because my brother is sleeping and he's going to complain if he hears me talking but the view though like you can hear you only see my my stupid face right now but the view let me show you Yellow skin, yellow dress, yellow clothes. Hey, we are now at Taormina, Taormina, and we're visiting. This city is quite small, so it doesn't take so long to visit. It reminds me so much of my childhood because I used to come here all the time when I was younger. And then we're gonna head to this amazing beach called Isola Bella, which literally means a beautiful island. Can you see the volcano?
This is a traditional, I don't know if it's Sicilian or if it's just Italian, but it's so good. It's like just this little brioche and there's this thing. And when I was a kid, I would only eat this for some reason. I don't know why. And it smells like... Don't touch me. It smells like... How do you call this in English? Um, you know, orange flowers it's delicious mm. so we just arrived in palermo it's already four so we don't have so much time but today was so hot that anyways even though we arrived really early that would have been impossible to do pretty much anything it was like at least 40 degrees i feel like i already got a sunburn just from being inside the car so today's outfit 